Whoever will be elected from those contesting will be faced with a daunting task. This is because the living standard of most of the Moses Garoid constituency residents have for long been begging for a decent life. There are municipal services in some quarters, but these are not sufficient for the growing population whom most live in undemarcated or unserviced plots. Their story has been told on numerous occasions. A lack of streets, residents living literally under high voltage electric cabling, not to mention a lack of ablution facilities in most parts. Community taps are also spread far apart, a risk for women to collect water when the night falls. This is Alma Festus. Her shack is constructed on what the city of Winduk would classify as an unsuitable area, but it withstood the test of time for over 10 years. With the vote for a new regional councillor just a few weeks away, there are some pressing matters that Festus would want the winner of the race to look at. So we really need councillor to provide us with toilets, building toilets, taxi rank in different uh, locations in Moses Carib. Many of her neighbours, such as Maria Ambambi, shares similar sentiments. A lack of development in the constituency is partly fueling criminal activities in the area. Uh, we are losing our phones, breaking house, and most of the things are being done in the darkness. We would like also to live like we are in windows, not like we are in farms. I, I, I want cancer bring here a toilet, a tax rank, and the uh, uh, road. All three women echo the same sentiment. The picture of Moses Barweb is one that does not belong on the mural of Ventuk and needs an overhaul. With the city of Ventuk currently without a political head, including a permanent administrative head, the NBC sought comment from city of Ventuk councillor Francina Kahungu on cohesion between the regional council and the Ventuk local authority to possibly fast track development in this area. It is time for us, the local authorities and the regional councils, to bring to the table ideas on how we develop these areas. But it does not help us to just come and sit around the table if we do not have the capacity. Kahungu has urged the incoming councillor to actively seek funds for the development of the constituency. Emil Sebeb, NBC News, Ventuk.